What is the hydraulic gradient of a 1 mile 17 inches inside diameter pipe? The 3,300 gallons per minute of water flows with F is equal to 0 0.03. Now first, what is a hydraulic gradient? Well, that is simply the change in water level, the unit of distance along the direction of maximum head decrease. So first, we need to write our givens. The length of the pipe is given to be one mile. Let's convert that into feet. Feet 5,280. The inside diameter of the pipe is 17 inches, which is about 1.417 feet. The flow rate Q is 3,300 gallons per minute. And we should convert this into cubic feet per second, which is going to be about 7.352 cubic feet per second. And then finally, we have an F is equal to 0 0.03. Now the F is usually, in fluid mechanics, it refers to the darcy weisbach friction factor. So that is a clue as to how we are going to get our answer. So the darcy weisbach equation is given by L is equal to the friction factor times the length over the diameter of the pipe multiplied by the velocity of flow squared over twice gravitational acceleration. Now we're given the F, we're given the L, we're given the D, we just need to find our velocity of flow here. Now, if you remember the continuity equation, Q is given by AB. We already have our Q, that is 7.352 cubic feet per second is equal to the cross-sectional area of the pipe, pi over 4, times the diameter of 0.417 feet squared times the velocity of flow. Now computing for this, pi over 4, 0.417 squared We get a velocity of 4.662 feet per second. Now we just separate this part. Okay, so now we can simply start putting our values in now that we know our V. HL is equal to friction factor 0 0.03 now we already have the units in feet so i'm not going to write them anymore 1280 over 1.417 v squared 0.62 divided by our gravitational acceleration in terms of um what the second squared there we go right this should give us a value of 37.7 feet now the hydraulic gradient equation is already appeared we just need to change delta h into h sub l and our unit of direction is well, the entire length of the pipe, which is big L, use big L for that. So HG is equal to HL over L. Just need to put our values in. 1280. If these are in feet, they would cancel out anyway. And we should get a value of 0. 00714 and that 
is our final answer. If this helps you, consider supporting the channel and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.